we can move to Stream Steel to create a new a new job in Stream Steel, which we're going to connect to the same project. Okay, so by clicking here on New, we can create a new um, job in Stream Steel. As you can see, the first thing that pops up is actually whether we want to connect, we want to link this job, this new job that we're creating in Stream Steel, to a Bean Server Center project or not. So we're going to do it and we're actually going to select the same project that we are um, have sent the info to, which is V4. And we're going to click accept and this uh, here will have the structure. So this is very important. This is the elements that uh, are going to be imported. So as you can see, circular hollow sections that we used in the model are being imported. Also rolled I simple sections and the number of them that are going to do, uh, be imported and whether we want to import them, all of them or not. Okay, so um, this is a new feature in the software uh, and uh, you can now import circular hollow sections. We're going to click accept and which see is, what... Which is our topic today. We are going to focus exactly, on... Exactly, which is our topic today. So uh, this is what uh, has been imported. Okay, so we can see if we click right here, since it's an um, beam model, uh, if I place uh, the mouse over this column, uh, it says it's a uh, description says this um, a circular hollow section, okay, uh, and it's uh, the its length is six meter six meters, sorry, and all of that. So that which was previously on um, on site three D. Okay, this is the model in Site 3D is now uh, converted to, sorry, being Server Center project. Okay, so uh, do you, can you see Douglas here, right here, this icon? Yes, I can. Connection. Does it look familiar? to you? It's just like Site Connect, right? Okay. Just like the logo so, of Site Connect. Exactly. This is what we were uh, talking about. Site Connect is uh, inside Strubium Steel. Okay, so you can do both the detailing and solve the connections. Let's uh, solve one. That's something see... that confuses some of my clients, so I'd like mm -hmm. to talk about this. So we yes. have Strubium Steel for detailing and we have Site Connect for designing the connections. If yes. you have uh, the license for Site Connect, you can access it inside Strubium Steel and then analyze it inside Strubium Steel. But if you only buy Strubium Steel, that's just for detailing, not for the connections also. That's a confusion that some of my clients have that they okay. think, okay, so then Strubium Steel immediately has Site Connect integrated. Mm -hmm. And these are two separate softwares that they work together but uh okay. there are two different licenses right yes there are two different licenses that's correct you need to have both of them to be able to do it i, I was to be able um, to use them together yeah you don't yeah, have to what go I meant is in to skype connect to work and then to Strubium. you go to Strubium Steel and keep working and that's exactly. it. That's what I meant. Exactly. Uh, yes, of course, you need a site connect license to analyze uh, the connections here, but uh, it looks just like site connect. The like connection um, icon right here looks just like a site connect. Um, and uh, if we access actually, if we uh, try to solve a connection uh, design it and analyze it here. You can do it only if you have Psychonic. That's correct. Okay, perfect. So um, by clicking on the bars that I want to um, make part of the in the connection, uh, this is what it looks like. Although, uh, we, well, I'll show you in a minute. Um, yes, I, what I wanted to show you is that now in these versions, you can actually add not only, um, uh, you can add, of course, uh, circular hollow sections. So uh, you can export the job from Site3D or you can start modeling right here. It's just that you're not going to have the loads, okay? But you could insert a bar right here 
an insert in stream steel bars and um, uh, for the detailing only you so actually you are don't going need... to get the loads if you bring it from site 3d from a previous software that does the loads analysis exactly so to see that because the loads are in the analysis step we have to first design the connection for that i'm going to be using um, the library connections library this is my own library okay it's not that comes with the, uh, the software you uh, can create your own library by designing your connections and export it to the library so for example just to show you um uh, the kinds of uh, connections that could be, although they're not all um, circular hollow sections, uh, we have many, I have so many, so I can bring, I can use them in other jobs. This is very interesting because when you um, invest some time in um, creating the, um, the connections, you want to have them for other jobs and that's exactly what we're going to do. I exported so these are all the connections that you have created and analyzed yourself. Exactly. I have uh, designed it with these tools, okay, these operations, and I have exported to the library. I won't show you in a minute. Okay. I'm going to bring it just to show you that you can use them. Like it's not that you do it once and then you forget about them or you have to repeat them again and again. No, it's just uh, a library that you create.